so today what we will do is we will try to you know proceed further as well as, as well as we will try to you know have some some kind of a quiz based on what we have learned in last few classes okay please close it please so this is a quiz from uh, w3 schools it's a good site in the notes also i mentioned this particular site to learn for uh, html css and other technologies so you can refer it so okay the first question what does html stand for hypertext markup language without doubt right who is making the web standards world wide web consortium right what is mozilla then it's a browser microsoft it is a software company right what are the browsers from microsoft edge and i the older one right google again a company right what is the browser from google chrome fine so this is the right answer fine choose the correct html element for the largest heading h1 and for the smallest h6 and what about this heading and head meta data comes in what head okay and what is heading is there something like heading now for such questions what i want is i want some people who can come and demonstrate over here like i want to prove h1 is the largest heading and h6 is the smallest heading so here we have got id open theek okay? hai i am going to save it as html file let's say control s save as uh where is the html can you see that yeah right okay let's say quiz right now who can let me just uh make the body even if i press uh, exclamation or even html if i just type html5 for example then the whole thing will be generated right now who can come and show me h1 is the largest and uh, h6 is the smallest heading you have to code here ब्रैकेट में टा sir i will show सेव कर दिया सर हाँ क्विज डॉट एस टी एम एल में सेव है
देखो मेरे पास एक क्लासिक इस क्लासिक को अभी तक ये फोल्डर दिख रहा है आपको ऊपर राइट ये इस साइड पे Is is one side. Because see, H one is written. H one is written H one, and that's the largest size, right? And the smallest size is in S two. Is S two okay? Yes, sir. Too long. Not too long. Okay. Not too long. 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 Too the file uh, quiz.html is inside c drive office then classes is starting from some some folder usko us form mein dikha raha hai right iske andar dikha raha hai achi i have told you uh, sorry sorry that's why i asked you whether you understand hindi or not i have to repeat it again so you can see the bro browser url right it's actually showing at the file system right that this file quiz.html is within c drive office and then under the folder classes starting from 2023 or what something like that right but remember when i told you that actually when you deploy the application whether it's a static application or dynamic application that will be running on a remote server and that when i say server it means a physical hardware as well as a software server installed on it right even though we do not have a different machine but to mimic that at least we should have a server and this file should have been deployed on that server how about that let's try that theek hai abhi tak hum simply kya kar rahe hain we are just trying to put the file html file in any folder and let the browser open it and interpret it but actually what happens when there is a client and server communication you are sitting remotely or with a laptop and just typing the url with that particular domain name or ip address and the control goes to that particular machine which is remotely somewhere across the world and the server returns back that html as a resource in the http response in the body of the http response this is what happens right so we we want to try to mimic that itself with this file itself okay now what we can do is you see you can see lot of options over here right extension go to the extension there is a live server installed and the install is showing live server because i have already installed it when you will install your visual studio for the first time this this will not be installed over there you will have to come over here and you will have to type live server and then it will search it and show it here theek okay? hai just like this theek okay? hai as of now it is showing launch a developer environment something like that it's already installed right in that case for the first time you will have to install it it will take a few seconds to install and once you are done the live server is installed now this is a live server which which is a very very basic server for a static deployment static content deployment which comes with visual studio as far as i know and let me be honest i am not a front end developer i am a back end developer middleware as well as back end developer theek okay? hai these things are something i have never done in my 9 years of career it career before 2014 theek hai i always worked on middleware as well as back end theek hai but still we understand the concept of server right so now i want to run this particular code that this person has written inside the server now so what i will do i will just come to the window this editor window enter pane and i will right click on it and you see open with live server theek hai uh something is going wrong let me do first thing let me stop the live server first so it is not already running let me try now file open folder kya keh raha hai Okay, just a second. Just a second. Open folder. Okay. Yeah, 
I will have to bring that whole folder as a workspace first. Okay, so there are different rules working with different IDs. I'm not very much familiar with Visual Studio because I've never worked with Visual Studio. Just to teach you, I, I installed it, right? So, anyways, so it, it may ask you about the window firewall uh, that you have to give the access to it, and then as soon as you do it, you will see window opens and the browser. You can see the the content running, and now you can see the notice the address bar URL bar. What's that? 127.0.0.1. This stands for the local host. Local host means this machine. So the IP address for local host is 127.0.1. I can also type local host, that's perfectly fine, or 127.0.0.1. Right? Then what does it say? Five five zero zero. That's the port number. The port number on which this particular server is listening. Okay. When I say run on server, so the control directly goes to this particular port with a request. It's not going to the file system like C drive, office, and all those folder structure. No. Okay. And then it is asking for resource which is with dot HTML. Fine. Clear it. Okay. <coughs> Let me do one thing. Let me align them side by side. Okay. In Mac machine, it is very, very nice. You can see in Mac machine, they have they have a very good thing that they can, you know, split the windows and that works very well. Just to demonstrate, here I have aligned both the windows, right? And what if I make any change? Say for example, a smallest heading. So let me say H6 is the smallest heading. Okay. I have to save it and then what I have to do? Earlier what I used to do, I have to refresh. I have to go to the HTML file and refresh. Let's see. I don't have to refresh. It's already, your ID is already connected to the live server. So as soon as I make a changes over here, the change is reflected over here. If you have a Mac computer, then you will really appreciate it because that is perfectly tiled and very easy to work. Okay. It's okay. Just, just to just to demonstrate that things are going live to the to the server. That's why they have given the name live server. Okay. Now it's very much we are trying to mimic like a client and server architecture. Okay. Then what was the next question? What about head? So head we know that it's for meta information. What about heading? Is there something called as heading? I want to figure out. Let's see. Head is coming. Header is coming. So I can see the help. There is nothing like heading, right? Uh, the largest heading, H1. Fine. Next. Which is the correct HTML element for inserting a line break? Yeah. Who can show me? And who can also show me whether others exist or not? Anyone else from him? Next, next person. Anyone who has written in the last two, three classes, two classes. I can't get the line table at the hour. Now, I got the better. Now, I can't do it. line the code is a potential logic as a software engineer. Okay, okay. 
हाँ सर लोड हो रहा ऊपर ये लोड हो रहा सर अभी नहीं वो तो दूसरा बिटो है ना बेटा तुमने कंट्रोल से यहाँ कर दिया है ना हाँ कर दिया अगर यहाँ कर दिया है तो ये सर में पीछे चला गया है आ गया तो बात लाइन ब्रेक अच्छा why why we are not able to see the line break लाइन ब्रेक इन दोनों के बीच में लगाओ ब्रेक देखो आ रहा है कुछ क्या नहीं सर ओके बी आर इज ओके सॉरी वॉट इज द करेक्ट एस्टिम फॉर एडिंग अ बैकग्राउंड कलर कलर वाला आगे ट्राई करो कौन करेगा आ जाओ देखो एक है बैकग्राउंड यानी बैकग्राउंड टाइप करोगे पहले फिर क्या करोगे बॉडी अगर है तो उसमें स्टाइल इज इक्वल टू बैकग्राउंड देखो कुछ है क्या ये बॉडी है तो बीजी इज इक्वल टू येलो है क्या ये देखोगे ठीक है फाइन ट्राई करो चलो और वो कहा गया राइट ट्राई करो
now choose the correct html to define important text okay try this kya hai b hai important hai i hai strong hai char hai na इससे पहले लगा के देखो क्या लग रहा है इसको 
टेस्ट किया है ओके देखो ये सी सी इज इज बोल्ड इज इज बोल्ड अगर नहीं होता तो क्या होता है जस्ट रिमूव इट नॉट बोल्ड राइट वॉट अबाउट अदर ऑप्शन से फॉर एग्जाम्पल आई italic then what was the other option strong 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 is there right giving the same result there is a difference we will see the difference later on but as of now just remember strong is also giving me the result of bold theek okay? hai somehow but there are limitations between strong and bold theek okay? hai there are difference then what was the last one important do we have anything called important say for example let me type something here and let me see is there anything important सर कुछ नहीं नहीं है नथिंग वी वांट टू डू आई वांट टू मेक कीप दिस एज बोल्ड एज वेल एज इटैलिक आल्सो लेट अस सी आई इज इक्वल इटैलिक जी सॉरी बोल दैट और इट मेक्स द सेम चेंज आल्सो दिस दिस वन ओके बट द रेस्ट इज नॉट सो वी वाइट सर सी यू नो बाय इंपॉर्टेंट रहेगा बी 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 इंपॉर्टेंट इज एज ऑफ नाउ मैं बी सिलेक्ट कर रहा हूं अदरवाइज बी और स्ट्रॉन्ग दोनों अभी वर्क कर रहा है बोथ बी एंड स्ट्रॉन्ग आर वर्किंग फॉर बोल्ड राइट नेक्स्ट इंफोसाइज मीन्स इटैलिक 
So we have already seen I. Yeah. Then uh, let's see. Let's see what about italic. Is there something called as italic? No. It's just I. Right. Then what was the other option? Em. What try करेगा? आप करोगे? अच्छा रुको. Next table आएंगे, ठीक है? The clothing tag has to go after the text. Italic हो गया? Em and I both seems to be working as emphasized, right? But again, just like bold and strong has a difference. I and EM has a difference. We will try to focus on it later on. Okay. Okay. Clear, isn't it? Okay, isn't it? Look, we are trying to try every option for two reasons. One is that you are getting familiar with the ID. You know that if you do not know anything, you can just check with the ID. The other thing is that what are the other options? Maybe they can give me some some other information. Okay. What is the correct HTML for creating a hyperlink? Who can now create a hyperlink and show me? Who will come? Will you come? Don't worry, don't worry. You are not alone here. I will do the whole class with you. I will do it, okay? Let's go. Now, let's do it. If you feel like it, then copy it. Thank you. 
कौन सा सही है भाई Which character is used to indicate an end tag? पीछे से कौन बताएगा आप लास्ट रो पे चलते हैं लास्ट रो में राइट पोस्ट क्या नाम है बेटा लास्ट लास्ट एकदम छुट करके यू बैठा हुआ है खड़े हो जाओ बेटा शकल दिख जाए क्या नाम है बताओ क्या गेस करोगे आंसर लास्ट वाला आगे दिखाओ मुझे करके शुरू कैसे पता चलेगा लास्ट वाला है हाउ डू यू नो दैट द लास्ट ऑप्शन इज करेक्ट सिंपल वी हैव सीन एवरी टाइम यू नो वेदर द टैग इज आई इट एंड विथ स्लैश whether tag is tag is b it ends with slash so every tag ends with a forward slash right right you star mere khayal se koi tag nahi hai to less than or greater than symbol ka hai star to tum agar star jaise comment mein lagana chahiye ya kuch chahiye us tarah ke liye i i i think so agar kuch hoga to aage dekh lenge theek hai हाँ कुछ टाइप करके देख लेना कैसा होगा तो हाउ कैन यू ओपन अ लिंक इन द न्यू टाइप ऑफ ब्राउजर नॉट टिल ना वर्ड वी आर डूइंग से अब तक क्या हो रहा है ये हमारे पास लिंक है वी हैव गॉट अ लिंक व्हेन वी क्लिक दिस लिंक दिस न्यू साइट इज बीइंग ओपन इन द सेम टैब सेम टैब नाउ व्हाट वी वॉन्ट आवर ओल्डर टैब शुड रिमेन देयर वी आर नेविगेटिंग टू अक्सटर्नल साइट सो लेट द होम पेज रिमेन देयर and the next side should open either in a new tab or new window theek okay? hai that is what we want to do so what are the options it's showing one is you along with the href attribute give the url w3 schools which we have already given and then 
target is equal to underscore blank what is this option or target is equal to new or just forget about target just type new these are the three options who is going to try piche wale aa jaiye bhai second piche second ha 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 aa jao कभी रेटमली भी उठाऊंगा बीच में से ठीक है एक तो से धड़क भी खुलनी चाहिए ठीक है और जो पीढ़ी खत्म को पता होगा तो वो भी चाहिए ठीक है अभी कुछ ऑप्शन है हमारे पास ठीक है आप ऑलरेडी देख रहे हो कि वी हैव गॉट दिस एच आर एफ ठीक राइट वेयर यू हैव मेंशन दैट यू आर इन एच आर एफ एट्रीब्यूट एंकर इज द टैब ए इज द टैब एच आर एफ इज द एट्रीब्यूट Where we paste under double quote the URL, and this text WT school site is something which comes underlined, and upon clicking it takes us to this particular site. Yes, it is clear. Now let's come back to here. Try one by one whether we have got another attribute along with href with the name target or not, and if we have whether we have got the values with blank, new, all these things or not. Okay, we have to try this. ठीक है एंड विच विल वर्क राइट चलो पहला ट्राई करो अब खोल लो इसको मिनिमाइज कर दो ब्लैंक न्यू एंड सिंपल न्यू राइट सो वन इज टारगेट यू हैव टू ट्राई अबाउट टारगेट सो जस्ट चेक हियर यू कैन टाइप अ न्यू एटीट्यूड ओवर हियर सी टारगेट इज कमिंग और नॉट कमिंग इंटर करो ऑप्शन का कमिंग यस There is no attribute, I think, with the new. Let's just. Nothing like new, right? Which is new, not coming. Okay. So uh, this one is the right. Fine. Next. <coughs> Which of these elements are? All table elements. Okay, we have not done table as of now, right? Anyone who is familiar with table? So that I. So, table ka example, pura batana mujhe ID pe hi. Kya karna hai? So what he has to do is he will try to create a table for me. ठीक है next table. And the table should have a header. then table row and within the table row table data so at least two rows and two rows and three data or column ठीक है सर सर क्या कौन मत नाम क्या डाल रहा है
नीचे लाइए अब यहाँ टेबल डाटा बनाएंगे निश्चित सेव किया आपने टेबल टेबल खत्म हुआ है आना चाहिए था नहीं लिया तो ऐसे ठीक है ठीक फाइन फाइन इसी जामी आमदद बी सी ए आ रहा है ना ओके okay. अब इसमें क्या करना है यू हैव यू हैव क्रिएटेड अ रो ठीक है सिमिलरली इफ आई वांट टू क्रिएट अनदर रो जस्ट लेट मी कॉपी इट एंड पेस्ट इट हियर लेट मी से यूनिवर्सिटी नेम इज से चलो जामिया मिलिया मिलिया कोर्सेज से एम सी ए और बी टेक वॉट एवर से फिफ्टी ये तो डेवलपमेंट है इसको इस पे ठीक है लेकिन ये ठीक है ना ठीक है फाइन सी वी हैव गॉट टू टेबल रोज एंड थ्री टेबल डाटा दैट इज थ्री कॉलम्स नाउ व्हाट आई वांट टू मेक आई वांट टू मेक द हेडर आल्सो ठीक है वी नो The first name is university name. The second column con contains the course, and the third column con contains the number of students. But we don't have a header to describe this, right? So what we can do is one thing is that we can we can just create another table row and type these things. Okay? But because table data is bold, we have to also make it bold also. Okay? We have specifically one you know nested tag within table, and that is called as टेबल हेडर ठीक है एंड हियर यू हैव टू यूज द सेम टेबल डाटा टेबल डाटा फर्स्ट टेबल डाटा व्हाट इज द फर्स्ट टेबल डाटा यूनिवर्सिटी नेम नेम गाइस अब मैं पिक करूंगा इस तरह जो बात कर रहा होगा और यहां अच्छे से जलाऊंगा आपको तो मत करो ऐसा जलाऊंगा कह रहा हूं जलाऊंगा समझते हो ना अच्छा अभी कुछ लोग एग्जांपल मिल जाएगा ठीक है अच्छे से और समझ में आ जाएगा नहीं करो ऐसा यार क्लास है थोड़ा सा डिसेंट रहो ग्रेजुएशन के स्टूडेंट हो तुम लोग एंड देन वॉट इज द लास्ट नंबर ऑफ टोलेस सम हाउ द फॉर्मेटिंग 
इज नॉट सो गुड ठीक है कोई फॉर्मेटिंग के बारे में कोई जानता है तो कैसे कर सकते हैं टेबल को रिफ्रेश नहीं हो रहा इसमें एक आता था एट्रीब्यूट कॉल स्ट्रिंग में लगा था एंड तो ये मर्ज कर लेता था तो उसका एट्रीब्यूट याद नहीं आया जैसे टेबल टाइप में एक एट्रीब्यूट रहता था नाम नहीं याद आ रहा उस एट्रीब्यूट का सेल स्ट्रिंग में कॉल स्ट्रिंग लो रन मैंने किया भी है ओहो नो 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 टेबल रो के अंदर कौन कर रहा है हां नहीं नहीं ये टीआर के अंदर ही टीए जाएगा ये तब आएगा फिर ये ठीक है टीआर वही बनाएंगे और उसके अंदर टीडी की जगह टीएच करेंगे सो वी आर डूइंग अ लिटिल मिस्टेक ओके लेट्स लेट्स करेक्ट इट सो दिस इज गोइंग टू बी असल में से एक ही फिर उसको ले लिया है ना टीआर ठीक है और इसको हम कहेंगे tr and this is table head nahi table head again let's connect it table head table head table head table head see ho gaya yes So we were doing a small mistake. Actually, for for header also, we will have to make the table row itself, and in, instead of TD, we have to use TH. So that was a mistake. Okay, fine. Now, if we want to say add some some background color inside it, so do we have something like color or BG color something? Let's see. Color, anything, anything. Do we have? Let me try it. Yeah. Okay. Fill out the chart a little bit. Anyways. So we are done with table, right? Now let's go to the question, the quiz. Which of these elements are all table elements? There's table row, there's table data, and there's table, right? Uh, fine. अभी तक हमने देखा तीनों हमने इनपुट कराया, right? Next question. Okay, let's leave it. I mean, line element. We have not seen it, so let's leave it. How can you make a numbered list? What have we we have used before? OL for numbered list. That means ordered list. We have used UL, which is unordered list. So there there will be bullets. 
but there will be no number in our unordered list so can someone try ol and and show show us here it has to be used use the just the same way as we have used the unordered list theek hai kon aayega ha bhai aap नंबर लिस्ट में थ्री बॉर्डर में आएगा थ्री टेबल बॉर्डर में आएगा यूएन की तरह सर ठीक है अगेन लिस्ट आइटम आइटम टू ठीक है अगेन इट्स वेरी सिंपल आपको बस ध्यान देना होगा चीजें बहुत आसान है दिस इज एस टी एम एल को मैं लैंग्वेज कहना ही प्रीफर नहीं करता हूं इट्स अ टैग लैंग्वेज ठीक है बट आपको एटलीस्ट सुनना तो पड़ेगा ना कंट्रोल एस Generate two. Now similarly, let it be there. Separately, make an order list with the same item. Am I clear? Take a pen, 
ಟೋಟಲ್ ಎಷ್ಟು ಸನ್ನತ್ರ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ ಚಲೋ ಹಟಾ ದೇತೆ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ನಹಿ ಅಭಿ ಕ್ಯಾ ಹೋ ಎಲ್ ಐ ಎಕ್ ಹುಆ ಅಚ್ಛಾ ದೇಖೋ ಯಾ ತುಮ್ ಕ್ಯಾ ರಖಾ ಜಬ್ ತಕ್ properly nahi hoga syntax it's it's not a compiled language that will show you error it will just not show you the results theek hai so what is the right answer order list do we have something called as list control is going to be pushed here we press control and space it will show the suggestions it says no suggestion so we don't have anything called list next how can you make a bulleted list that is an ordered list is a bulleted list you are is okay fine so let's stop here theek hai aaj ke liye itna theek hai